All right, guys, I'm going to show you really quick. How do you tile a large Im image and when you're printing it? And what I mean by tiling, it's kind of like when we talked about in Bloxels and you have um, a section, like a square of it, and you're just repeating it over and over. It's kind of similar in the way that this, with tiling, with printing, with an image, has to do with how can sp split it up, okay, um, this entire image into smaller pieces so that it will print on the printer, like, with a paper size it can handle, okay? So here's my file. I've blown it up to 11 by 17. I'm going to go to File, and I'm going to hit Print, or you can hit Command-P. Um, here's my settings. It really doesn't matter what your printer is because down at the bottom where it says Scaling, right now it says there is no scaling because I can see in my preview it's just fitting what it can on a eight and a half by eleven sheet because that's all my um, printer can handle and that's the same for the animation printer in the room if I go to tile image imageable areas okay now it's split it at one two three four five six so that will print on six eight and a half by eleven sheets of paper now if I do tile full page it's just two but I don't think that animation printer will allow you to print full bully, you know, print all the way like to the edge, like right to the edge of the paper. So this would not work. So I would need to change it and say imageable areas. And then you're going to get six pieces of paper that it's going to print. Now, when I go to marks and bleeds, I like to include, I don't need all of this, but I do need and page information is nice in case um, your stuff gets like split up and somebody else is printing right behind you. Um, so you're like, oh, I want to make sure my stuff gets in there so um, that I know which pieces of paper are mine. Um, so I do want the trim area because trim is basically where is the actual paper size where it would get cut. Okay, so that's going to be the 11 by 17 spread out on the six sheets of eight and a half by 11 pieces of paper and then I would click the print button. Now, I don't want to do that here at home so normally I would just hit print and then those sheets of paper would come out of the animation printer and you need to go pick them up. It's 